Hello everyone, in today's video I'm doing something a little bit different from what I normally do. So these past few weeks have been kind of crazy in my life. We had a winter storm last week which caused me to go without power for like three or four days. So I'm pretty far behind on filming and because of that I was not able to film an unstuffing video. In fact, the day that I was going to film, it was the same day that I did my last cash on stuffing, which I'll link above and below in case you guys want to watch that. But I had turned off the camera after I filmed that video. I went back to go organize all my stuff and then my power went out. So that same day that I was going to film that, my power went out and uh, I haven't got to film it yet. So I did already unstuff all of my bills because obviously I had to pay them. Some, you know, I do have buffer in my uh, checking account, so they're covered, but I didn't want to go too long without putting them back in my bank. So I already unstuffed all of my bills, but in this video, I'm going to be doing my cash stuffing as well as going through and uh, doing like a cash exchange or like a bill exchange. So I'm hoping this isn't going to be a super long video. I, I'm not trying to be, you know, <laughs> I don't have you guys here for like 30 or 40 minutes, but that's going to be the plan for today. So let's go ahead and get this money counted and organized and then we will get stuffing. And really quickly, I forgot to mention that we are working with a total of $1,121 today. So last week's income was as follows. I didn't work Monday. I never work Sunday or Monday. I'm off every Sunday, Monday. But on Tuesday, I made $214. And then Wednesday, Thursday, I wasn't able to work. I didn't have power. So Friday, I made $588. And then Saturday was $319. Let's go ahead and get this counted. We have 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50, 70, 90, 210, 30, 50, 70, 90, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 30, 50, 70, 90, 7, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 8, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 9, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 1,010, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 5, 90, 5, 100, so it's 1,100, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Let's get this organized. Okay, I hope that looks good for y'all. So again, let's just go ahead and get like dive right into it. Let's get straight into it. Starting off with rent. Rent is gonna get 250 as always. For those of you who are new, I do split all my household bills with my boyfriend. This is my half of the rent. So I'm gonna do that 50 and then I'm gonna do 220s. So 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 90, 90, and two. For those of you guys who are from Texas like myself, I hope that everything is good with y'all. It, it affected a lot of Texas, so I hope you all are warm and safe out there. Let me get this double counted though. 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50, 70, 90, 210, 30, 50. Okay, and then let's get this counted. Rent now has 51, 150, 70, 90, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 3, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 4, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 5, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 6, 10, 30, 40, 50. 650 now in rent. Moving on to my subscription envelope. So, uh, unfortunately, so with my labels, I had ordered them uh, about a month ago, just about a month ago. And after, after like two or three weeks, I was like, okay, like this is taking a little bit longer than I thought. So I went and double checked the shipping. They were supposed to have been uh, delivered by like the 21st through the 27th. And at this time it was already past those dates. So I reached out to the seller. I didn't hear anything back. I reached out again, I didn't hear anything back. So I went ahead and did a refund so that way I can find a different seller for these labels because I really need to get them in. I was planning on having this video be the video where I have all of my new envelopes, but unfortunately that's not the case. It is something I'm working on. Just so you guys know, I just wanted to give you all an update because I know I keep saying I'm gonna have new labels, I'm gonna have new labels. That's why I haven't done them and that's why they're not here because I have not received them yet and now I have to order different ones. But anyway, miscellaneous is gonna get five. Again, this is my subscriptions. 20, 40, 50, five now in there. 
Up next is cell phone. It's gonna get 25. Let's just do 30. So that brings cell phone to 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 50, 150 now in cell phone. One of my main goals is to get three months ahead on all of my envelopes, I'm sorry, all of my bills. I was able to get a month ahead on everything but rent last year, so my new goal is to get three months ahead on all my bills. Starting off small, I still am not a month ahead on my rent. It's just a work in progress, but that is one of my goals this year. Electric is gonna get 35, so let's do 40 instead. Put, pop that five back in there. So 20 and 40. That brings electric to 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 50. 150 now in there. For my childcare, it gets its usual 70. My son goes to an after school program. So 20, 40, 60, 70. That brings child care to 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 80, 2, 20, 40, 50. So 250 now in child care. Which is great because the rate is 270 a month. I just paid it and I already have 250. So that is really good. I'm almost getting a month ahead on this one. This is another one that I haven't quite gotten there yet, but I'm getting very close. Internet's gonna get five. So that brings internet to 20, 40, 55. For dental insurance, I'm gonna go ahead and put five. So let's do a 10 instead, which brings that to 30. Health insurance is gonna get 10. So you're gonna pop this kind of nasty looking one in there. Brings health insurance to 20, 40, 60, 70. Thank you guys for the feedback on my most recent video. I did get a new phone or my most, I guess it was a couple of videos back, but I did get a new phone and I'm hoping that the quality stays good. Um, but yeah, thank you guys. Debt fund's gonna get 250. So let's do 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 50. Oh man, we're well, yeah, running out of change. And that brings debt fund now to 1, 50, 70, 90, 2, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 3, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 4, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 5, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 6, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 7, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 8, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 9, 10, 30, 50, 60. 960, which means that I am missing. Did I count that wrong? 960. This should be a thousand which means that I'm missing two 20s. So, so I counted something wrong. I'm gonna put two 20s in here because that's what it's supposed to be. And if I'm wrong, then we'll fix it later. Well, that should be a thousand, so I'm gonna put it back in there. And then we're gonna move it right along. All right, so that leaves 466 remaining. Moving uh, into cash envelopes, starting off with gas. This is gas for my car. It's gonna get 30, so let's do 20. 530, which brings gas to 25, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 35 in there. So groceries is up next. It's going to get 56. I'm going to do 66 instead. So 20, 40, 60, 5, and 6. That brings groceries to 20, 40, 65, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70. And y'all, the cost of groceries is just getting insane. I went to the store the other day and I spent like a hundred bucks and I came home with basically nothing, like eggs, milk, bread. It was crazy. Spending's gonna get 20, so I'm gonna pop a 20 in there. And then dine out is getting 25. So we'll do a 20 and a five. And I just realized while I'm doing this that I, I, I got my coffee and I, I really just wanted the taste of coffee. So I was like, oh, okay, I'll do a decaf. I completely forgot to do that, and that's a regular coffee, so good luck falling asleep. Uh, 20, 40, 50, no, 20, 45 in Dine Out. And this envelope is used for my boyfriend and I. Ties is gonna get its usual 10, so I'll pop that in there, and that's what that has. All right, so uh, 141 went into cash envelopes, 325 remaining. And really quickly, I'm gonna do my Saveopoly challenge. I have $25 left over for that. 
Uh, unfortunately, it's not gonna cover all the ones that are on here, so we're gonna have to do what we did last week, and if we land on something that we can't um, stuff, then we'll have to re-roll. But let me go ahead and get all of the goodies out. And I'm gonna get a sip of coffee. Okay, so we were on 18 last week, which is right there. Let's go ahead and roll. Three, one, two, three, so I can't save 50. I'm gonna roll again. Two, so one, two is save 20. That I can do. So 20 going in there. Let's grab a $20 bill. And then figure out where I wanna put this $5. And again, I'm not gonna be counting this challenge just like I did in last year because I do wanna be surprised. I'm not sure I'll be doing the giveaway I did last year, but I had a really great time with you guys, so I'll probably be doing something similar. Let me write that down and figure out where I wanna put that five bucks. Alrighty, y'all. Now, before we get into the rest of these sinking funds, I thought it would be best to go ahead and do some bill exchanges. So, that being said, I do need some big notes in order to do this. So, I'm gonna go ahead and go into my Roth because I know I need a $500 placeholder in here, and that'll give me some change to work with as we go through these sinking funds. So, let's see here. Um, yes. So 1, 2, 50, 70, 90, 3, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 4, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, and 500. So that'll give me one, I guess, two $100 bills to work with. That way we can put those somewhere else. And let me see if there's anything else in here that I can do. This might be it. Forgot to put the actual placeholder in there. Let me grab that. I do have these listed in my Amazon storefront if you guys are ever interested in purchasing these. They look super real. I've got a ton of comments on them. I really like them, so if you're ever interested. But that, I think, is going to do it. I think we only have this one placeholder swap, so kind of a light, kind of a um, light unstuffing there, bill exchange. That does give me some more change to work with, so that's good. A couple fives in here. And then we'll get back into the cash stuffing. Okay. Back into my sinking funds. It's starting off with Christmas. Now, I don't want to put that 100 just willy-nilly. I think I'm just going to go ahead and put that back in my Roth. So for Christmas, I'm going to put 25. So 25. And then I'm gonna do any kind of um, small bill consolidation. So for instance, these two tens, I'm just gonna go ahead and swap out for a 20. because so I do have a ton of 20s. So that's what I'll be doing. It's not my favorite. I really wanted to have done the unstuffing, but it is what it is. That brings Christmas to 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50, 75. So 175 now in Christmas. Next up is my essentials. This is my kind of catch-all envelope. It's medical, uh, co-pays, vitamins, you know, medicines, all that. It's going to get five, so I'm going to pop a $5 bill in here. And that brings essentials to 20, 40, 55, 6, 7, 8, 9, 60. So 60 down there. Definitely don't need to do any kind of exchanges because I like having change. I use that envelope quite often. My son's envelope is gonna get 25, so I'm gonna do a 20 and a five, and then I'm definitely gonna exchange these smaller bills. So one, 2,000, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 35, 45, 50. So 21, 50. Mm, do I wanna do that 50 in here? I might just do that 50 in here, actually. So. 20, 35, 45, 50. Yep, I think that's what I'll do. And I'll just pop that in there. That gives me some extra change. And that is good. Moving along to vacation, it's gonna get 25. So let's see what we can do in here. That's 20 and that is five. So 1, 20, 40, 60, 82, 5, 10, 15, 25. So 25, which means 
I can pop these four up here and just grab a 20. Next up is clothing, which is gonna get skipped, but my car insurance, I did finally pay this. Starting over fresh for the new policy, I'm gonna put 35 in here. So 20, 30, and five. So that is what that envelope has in it now. Up next, okay, so birthday is gonna get skipped. Household is the next one, it's gonna get five. So let's just do 10. And that brings that one to 30. For hustle, we're going to go ahead and put five, which would make that 20. So 10, 15, and five is 20. And after I'm done stuffing, there should be 500 bucks in here. I'm going to make sure I'm going to double count because I know that that debt fund envelope kind of got me, I don't know, got me questioning myself. Car maintenance is gonna get five, so that would be, that's 20. Let me put this five to stuff, and then I'm gonna put 20, because that's just a better looking five, um, 20 in here. That brings car maintenance to five, six, 50, 70, 90, five. So 695 now in car maintenance. For diapers, this is for future children. It's gonna get two. And let me go ahead and pop two in here. And that brings diapers now to one, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, one, two. So 22, this looks, these two look good. Let me just go ahead and replace that with a 20. Perfect. I miscounted that. Okay, yeah, no, that I, I definitely messed that up. So I need to put this 10 back because I should have put 10 and 10 ones. So it is 122. Okay, that is good to go. Moving on to wedding. This is for a future wedding. It's getting $2. So one and two. Can you guys tell I'm like super tired? Uh, wedding now has 1, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2. And I'm going to do it the correct way this time and grab this 10 and 10 ones and grab a 20 instead. All right. Moving along to my other sinking fun binder. And I am going to stuff my mystery scratch off. So I do have that. I'm going to go ahead and pop pop it up here but um it's in my car payment envelope again i don't have the right labels but i'm gonna go ahead and stuff that here in a second getting into this one annual fees up first and it's gonna get five so let's do these look good that one looks pretty good so adding 15 that would make that 20 and that brings Annual fee to 20, 40, and a five. Next up is holiday fund. Um, Valentine's Day is coming up. I'm gonna give my kiddo some of the little Valentine's Day card thingies. Let me know in the description box down below, how do you guys celebrate Valentine's Day, if you celebrate Valentine's Day, because being in the service industry, I worked most Valentine's Days. They're pretty good money, so it's just like you, you feel like you have to. But uh, my boyfriend and I, we actually met in the service industry, so we don't, we don't celebrate Valentine's Day. Let me know, though, if you guys celebrate what y'all are doing. This is going to get, Holiday Fund is going to get five. So I'm going to do, that's a 10. Let me go ahead and grab this five because it looks good. And then I'm going to grab a 10 to replace these. So that now has 35 in it. For my car's registration, I'm gonna go ahead and put five in here. That would bring that to 20. So that's 10, five, and then the five going in there would make 20. And we have 60 already in there. My registration is up in July of this year, so we have plenty of time. Dental fees were added that extra $5 because I am getting my wisdom teeth extracted. Uh, this next Monday, 
and I need to make sure I have the right copay for that or like out of pocket expense for that. So 13 going in here, that would be 23 and that would be 25. So I'm gonna grab a 20, better looking 20, a 20 and a five. And that brings in all fees to 150, 70, 90, to 10, 35, 235 now and there. Tattoo fund is gonna get skipped as well as back to school, but emergency is gonna get that 23 bucks. So 20 and three ones, one, two, three. That brings emergency now to 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 115, so let me go ahead and grab a better looking 10 since we are doing a bill swap. A better looking 20, because why not? You know what, two of those. Oh, that actually looks good, we're good. And what was I saying? A better looking 10, and then a five for these five ones. And this one looks good. This one looks really good. Let me make sure I counted that correctly. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 10, 15. 1, 15, yep. If you guys are doing this challenge with me, let me know in the, um, in the comment section. Beauty is going to get 10. So, ooh, we got lots of change. 10, 15, 20. This is going back to the bank because it's crazy bad. So I'm putting 10 in there, that would be 15, that would be 20, so I'm gonna throw a $20 bill instead. So 20, 40, 60, 75, 6, 7, 8, 9, 80. I do wanna keep some of that change in there because that is one that I dip into. Gonna go ahead and do my Roth and then we'll do the scratch challenge. So Roth is gonna get 100. I'm gonna go ahead and pop that $100 bill in here. Stop, I had 200s, that's fine. I'm gonna go ahead and put it in emergency here in just a second. And I said that earlier, I was like, there's two of them and then I just didn't register. Okay, cool. Um, and that is also 100. Ooh, do I wanna put it in here? Or do I wanna put it in, I think I wanna put it in emergency. Um, really quickly though, before I count this, I'm gonna exchange these for a 20, just so I can get that over with. And Roth now has one, two, three, four thousand, five, six, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty-seven. So forty-seven hundred now in Roth. Very quickly, I'm going to exchange this for emergency. I'm going to pop a hundred-dollar bill in here. Twenty, forty, sixty, eighty-one. Takes care of that. And then I'm going to throw ten dollars into this car payment car payment and well it is car payment but into this envelope for my mystery scratch challenge so I did scratch this last week I will not be scratching one for next week because this month is being it's like really really weird for me and I don't want to like overdo it for myself um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and do the 10 that I scratched for last week because I already have it allocated these us tens oh that's a good one okay cool and then I'm gonna count that and make sure that we have $500 because that should be going to the bank Alrighty. Lots of ones. So 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 94, 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 80, 1, 2, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ninety, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, five hundred. Perfect. So it all worked out. I love when that happens. Alrighty, guys. So that is it for this weird kind of cash stuffing for week one of February slash kind of a bill swap. I will be getting back into schedule this next week. So thank you all for your patience. We are getting back on track, and I will absolutely do be doing a February bill swap and unstuffing. But until then, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.